Hi everyone! Today we're going to learn about a magic word that we can use in different contexts to sound like a native. We're going to learn about Befarmaid with Persian movie Doran Ashari, Time to Love. But before we do, I want to let you know we make fun lessons with your favorite movies and more so you can understand fast speaking Persians. Like Zizi who says, because of our videos, she feels she could understand and speak Persian more like a native. And you can too. All you have to do is to hit that subscribe button and the bell below so you don't miss any of our new lessons. First, watch the video with subtitles. Then learn with the clip. And finally, watch without subtitles and take the quiz. We have more to offer. Visit our website to complete interactive online activities and download complete lesson for this episode. Come be fan. Shoma un otak tashrif bebayin. Befarmay shoma. Befarmaid has different meanings in different contexts based on your tone and intonation. You need to know that the written form is Befarmaid, but you usually hear native speakers pronounce it as Befarmaid. You can use this word to offer someone to enter a place or say come on in or go ahead. You should know that this phrase is considered formal by natives. Tashrif bebarit can be used instead of befarmaid in more formal contexts or when you want to show more respect to someone. Here the law of a secretary is talking to a client and uses both befarmaid and tashrif bebarit to ask the client to enter the room. Please notice that in fast spoken Persian, re is not pronouncing tashrif bebarid. And native speakers would say tashrif bebarid. I need to mention that befarmaid is formal and second person plural, which represents you plural. The singular and informal form is befarma, and you can use it with your close friends in informal situations. In this scene, Leila, who's a divorce lawyer, is offering her new client to take a seat. This is a very polite way to ask someone to sit down. The lawyer, instead of asking her client, how may I help you or what can I do for you, she just tells her, Befarmaid. Don't miss the next episode to see how this case changes the lives of both of them since the lawyer has to open a case against her own husband. Here are some other usages of Befarmaid. It is also used when giving something to someone, usually after a request for the thing. For example, when you give the bill to the customer, you can say, there you go, or Befarmaid. Befarmaid is also an informal idiom which can be used when someone messes up something and you want to tell them this is the consequence. When you fail a test, your parents could say with a serious tone, Befarma or Befarmaid, to say you see or didn't I tell you to study? You can also use Befarmaid when you're actually 
handling someone a physical object. So if you're enjoying this video, then I bet you, you really like this other one that we did. You can check that out after you finish this one by clicking up here or down the description below. Now let's watch without subtitles and take the quiz. شما اون اتاق تشریف ببرید شما اون اتاق تشریف ببرید بفهمید شما Don't hesitate. Learn how to speak like a local and make real connections by subscribing to Talk Like a Persian's YouTube channel or becoming a member at TalkLikeAPersian.com.